Oh man, this place is terrifying. Oh crap, what was that? I just heard something. It sounded like a voice. There's that humming again. I can't even tell which direction it's coming from. It's like... What's up fam, Jared Bear here, back for another adventure. Today's adventure, we are back at the Haunted Molly Stark Sanatorium. It's the night before Halloween. I just got in here. This place is being watched right now, so we're going to have to make it real quick. But I did want to come here because I know this place is confirmed haunted. But anyway, guys, I'm going to put some tags periodically through the beginning here. Of some other explorers that I just had recently that was really cool. There was a haunted prison. A mega church me and my wife just shot that ended up being really awesome and crazy. Like, we ran into people. Cops were called. The whole nine yards. It was nuts. Go check that hey out. Hey, guys, I try to upload at least one video for you a week. Sometimes, too. So if you like crazy, fun adventures, you like haunted, spooky things, and you like crazy abandoned exploration smash that like hit that subscribe join the family and let's get it okay you guys keep your eyes and ears open like i said this place is confirmed haunted there's another youtuber he was just actually put on a paranormal show because he sent in a clip he was here walking in the tunnels and caught an apparition and at first i mean it was such a good apparition i guess i didn't get to see it but i heard about it but i guess it was such a good apparition that he thought it was a person at first until he realized he was following it and realized it was went to a dead end scared the crap out of him and then he left but look at this place so the guys i was just talking to outside actually watching it so i went around the other side of the building looking like i was just taking pictures and uh wow what's that say if you want to live okay we're gonna go the other side though because they're on this side here and i don't want them seeing my, our lights in here But yeah, let's keep our eyes open for apparitions. Now, people that worked here before it closed, so it was a tuberculosis hospital. And at the moment, I can't remember all the dates. The very first video, explore video, that I ever filmed was this place. And I go uh, deeper on the history in that video at the beginning. So if you want to hear more history about it, then... Uh, um go check out the molly stark series that's so wow flooded oh boy I am nervous. I am all by myself, all alone, wanting to get some... What is that down there? Wanting to get some spooky stuff for Halloween film for you guys. I just heard, like, footsteps. So after it was a tuberculosis hospital, it then became a hospital for sort of like, uh, I guess, ooh, ooh, what was that? So it became a hospital for like uh, mental patients and, and uh, addiction and stuff. And um, 
the workers then would report. What does that say? Let the blood of all humanity. Okay. Actually, I got the K2 meter. We're going to get that going. Let's see if we get any weird kind of anomalies. So workers were reporting hearing voices coming from the tunnels, which I'll take you to the mouth of the tunnel. And stuff would be getting moved around and thrown. There would be dark figures like uh, shadow figures and stuff seen. There's also a reported man in a brown suit that'll be seen here also as well. So let's keep our eyes open for a man in a brown suit. Shadow apparitions and um, white mists will be seen. The tunnels are down that way. I'm not stepping in that thing. Man, guys, I sure hope we don't get caught, though. Like I said, they got people watching it right now because a lot of people around Halloween want to come and get scared here. This place is terrifying now. So, as I was saying, Silly Plush Studios has uh, commented in some of my videos. They've been here multiple times. And they say that they've had a little girl by the name of Josie come through the spirit box multiple times. And anyway, so my belief on that whole thing, guys, is... It's a demon acting as a little girl. I don't think there's a spirit of a little girl running around here. I think demons, they act like things to try to fool us and to communicate with them. Oh my goodness, I'm so freaking nervous right now. Like I got goosebumps everywhere. I just heard something from over here. Oh my goodness. Hold on, let me see if they followed me over to this side. Okay, so far so good. I'll take you guys back down, show you the tunnels. It'd be crazy if we hear get some voices. Ooh. It was like a little, sort of sound like a, ch a chirp. It's easy to get turned around in here. This place is massive, really. Who was in Paris? I don't know what that means. Oh, 
look, this had like old wallpaper on it. Sort of a egg Bulgarian. Huh. Alrighty. Egg Bulgarian. Whatever that means. Hope you guys can hear me good. I do have a mask on because this place is loaded with asbestos. And uh, like I said, my first time here, I was in here well over an hour with no mask, no nothing. Check those hospital beds out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Something's here with us. It stopped. So I sort of feel like I'm going the wrong way. No, we're going the right way, okay. Going up those steps and coming back down another set of steps got me screwed up. Just jumped again. Check that out. Oh boy. What was that? I gotta find the tunnels for you guys. to turn off dark main tunnel all right Oh man, this place is terrifying. Oh, did you hear that? Right here's the tunnels. So this is where, uh, the other YouTuber, I'd say his name, I just don't know it, guys. But he captured an apparition down here. Right now they're pretty flooded. See if, see if anything happens. Oh crap, what was that? I just heard something. It sounded like a voice.
I'm a little nervous about getting caught too. You guys hear that? I just heard humming. Something was just humming like a like a song. Where is that coming from? There are satanic stars all over the place. I have a feeling this place is filled with demons too, just because all the... Oh, I forgot. Okay. All right, I remember where we're at. We got to go this way. Where was that humming coming from? It did sound like a woman humming. But I don't believe when we die that we, like, stay here. You know, the Bible doesn't mention that. I do believe in angels and demons being here. And I think most of the time, like, we start calling out for something to communicate with us. And a demon answers us. And it'll play as a little girl. Or it'll act like grandma or grandpa. And people are like, it's got to be because they knew. Only grandma would have known about that or something. But see, these demons have been around for a long time. And they know too, especially if a demon's been in your family. And they know. They know you guys. And they can portray like they're somebody else so that you communicate with them. Ooh, Halloween guys you can't get really more of a spookier place than this for Halloween there's that humming again I can't even tell which direction it's coming from it's like okay guys I was just getting some pictures and I heard a I don't even know how to explain it it was like a big freaking growl my hair is standing up on ends right now I'm not feeling comfortable how do I get out of here oh, that place is freaking terrifying I can't believe it it was loud that was freaking loud, man. So I could hear humming. I think I was on camera when I mentioned hearing like humming. I cut twice, I heard humming. It sounded like a woman humming. So then I wanted to take some pictures of this cool looking, uh, it was like a hospital bed and a counter and everything. And there was this little thud and this loud, loudest growl I've ever heard. And it, it sounded like it was right by me. And man, it just felt like, it just felt dark, it felt bad. So I'm out, I'm out now. Whew. We didn't get caught, that's good. Man, look at that place though. I gotta get you guys up there someday, that's cool. And some of the other videos, we are up there. What a beautiful building, it's sad too. The fellas I was talking to earlier, they're actually on the other side over there. And uh, their garden, I think their garden, there's an easy way in right now. And they're sitting right by the easiest way in right now. And I think it's to deter people. Like I said, Halloween coming in here, you know, 
Man, it's cold out right now. Anyway, spooky season's here tomorrow night as Halloween. If you guys go out to trick or treat or whatever it is, you have fun, be safe, and have a happy Halloween. Hey, smash that like, hit the subscribe, join the family, and until next time, peace. Love you guys.